Hey guys, Mechanic CG here, and welcome back to another episode of Doom Eternal. Today is episode number four. Hopefully, you guys do enjoy. Fortress of Doom. Oh, nice. Where is this that we're at then? You can now find the remaining health priests by activating your celestial locator. The second health priest is located in the northern region of Earth. I will calibrate the portal now. <coughs> has several areas locked off due to power constraints. Once power has been restored, you will be able to access the entire ship. Oh nice, restore power. Sentinel batteries, insert sentinel batteries into sockets within the Fortress of Doom to unlock items and power up parts of the Fortress. Sentinel batteries can be found in missions or earned by completing all three of the mission challenges. Okay, so I have one to put in here. Sentinel energy levels rising, re-establishing power to core and supplementary systems. Acquire the ice bomb. What's this? Press LB to launch an ice bomb. Press uh, left on the D-pad to swap with a fragmentation grenade. The explosion temporarily freezes any demons hit by the blast. Combo it with other weapons. Interesting. What on earth is this? Wow, this looks cool. It's an entire ship. It's massive. Holy crap, this is massive. What's this? Where's this taking us? Uh, punish demons in the prison. Repertorium, activate. Demon Prison. The Demon Prison allows you to practice fighting demons without dying or permanently losing inventory such as ammo and extra lives. New encounters unlock as you progress through a campaign and discover new demons. Exit through the portal when finished. Oh wow, this is sick. I like how they have music from Doom 2016 as well. Some of the really good songs. This one was an amazing song. I was about to say banger and then I realised I'd probably say that word a bit too much. Oh, this is insane. You know, they've put so much new stuff in this game. It's so cool. For anyone who doesn't want to buy this, it's understandable. This is one of those games that I would highly recommend. Um, but obviously, Bethesda, they always like um, putting their Game Pass games onto... Uh, their games onto Game Pass after about a year or so. So expect to see this probably on Game Pass at some point. Uh, acquire a Praetor suit point. Oh, wow. What is that? Here we go. Prayer to suit. Uh, spend prayer to suit points to purchase prayer to suit perks. Prayer to suit perks enhance your abilities or unlock new abilities. Okay. Wow. Okay. Ice bomb, frag grenade, environment, exploration, and fundamentals. Uh, we're going to have to go for... 
Hazard protection. Red suit takes less damage from toxic sludge and toxic water. Reveals auto map station location on the auto map. Reveals all progression items on the dossier. Uh, or we've got faster ledge grab and monkey bars. Yes, totally. Faster one of them is very useful. Grappler unlocked. Ah, yeah, that's a that's the name of the thing. Oh wow, week one challenges. Uh, so kill three arachnotrons with the full auto mod. That's the spiders, isn't it? Thirty enemies with blood. Pu okay, that is nice. We'll take that Praetor suit token. Thank you very much. Uh, configure the mission teleporter. Okay, nice. Uh, we got to find a way all the way back upstairs. Is this it? Yes. This is an arc broadcast. Oh, arc bro broadcast. Or survivors operating inside the Hellified zones. Please be advised. More coming in. Arc leadership do not recommend any attempts to communicate with the Slayer directly. Please avoid all contact with Doomguy at this time. While it is clear that the Slayer is an enemy of the challenge, it is unclear if he could also be a threat to civilians. Well, we are not a threat to civilians. We are only killing the demons. Cultist base campaign mission. Um, so, I've got my first video actually rendering as of right now uh, to go up live. I mean, it's still day one uh, of the game being launched. Um, but the interesting thing is, the last episode, I managed to record a 9 gigabyte video file. My typical, like, 40 minute video is normally about 4 gigabytes. So, um, yeah, it was a very long recording session for that. Um, so when I come to edit that, I'm probably going to have to end up doing it in two parts. Right. Here we go. Oh! Okay, let's... Let's try this. Okay, so ice... That is interesting. Okay, right. Okay, up there. Climb wall! No, you gotta climb the wall. Oh, no, 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 no. Get back, get back. There we go. Climb wall. Now, I'm guessing that's where we go, but there's red stuff on there. There we go. Kill burning demons to drop the most amount of armor. Let's set these guys on fire! Oh my gosh, look at the armor that's just coming out of these guys. I have like armor for days here. Microwave time. Ready and kaboom. Pop. It's lovely. Infiltrate the cultist base. Right. Uh, Hell Priest is somewhere. Oh, Jesus. Microwave time. 
Lovely. Right, so we need a cultist key. Um, obviously a yellow pass key by the looks of it. What's this? <gasps> that is... That actually scared the life out of me, I'm not gonna lie. Um... Right, so we need to work out a way through there. Oh, there's a way through here. Never mind. Ignore me. Welcome, Slayer. Is my time at an end? Let's see if you're strong enough to survive this cursed city. Come on, come on. Gotta get rid of Beefy Boy here. Goodbye, Beefy Boy. Head just got chopped off. Has arrived. All mortally challenged personnel, please be advised. Hmm. Okay, weak point, Mancubus. Uh, the Mancubus is a long-range heavy demon that uses a flamethrower when close. Its arm cannons are weak points. Destroy them, weakens its projectiles, and disables its flamethrowers. AKA Big Chungus is back. Big, meaty, Chungus. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh, what on earth was that? Oh my gosh, there's another big chungus. There's two of them. There's two big chunguses. Right, take out weak spots. Arms. Arms are always weak spots. Let's get rid of you, get rid of you. Come on. Oh my gosh! Oh, gobble gobble! Right, time to microwave him. Oh my gosh! You can chainsaw big chunguses now! So big chungus is only three fuel now. Prayer to token, thank you. Thank you very much for your kind gesture. Okay, just about made that. Right, there's one of these here, hang on. I want to try that blood puncher thing. Because we need to, like, use... There we go. There you go. Gobble, gobble. Oh my gosh, this is insane. Okay, hang on. Come on.
Cultist key acquired. Let's go. Total destruction. We're back in the exact same room as before. We've just bent his skull backwards. Lost souls as well we've got, which are the um, sort of homing missiles, pretty much. Microwave time. Ah. Big beefy boy, go away. Right. Absolutely demolished. Right, we've got to get this guy. Oh, right in his flamethrower. Uh, energy shields. The plasma rifle can quickly destroy energy shields, which will trigger a damaging explosion. Okay, interesting. Oh, I haven't seen this menu yet. Um, plasma rifle. Here we go. Holy crap. Okay. I see how it is. Okay, hang on. Okay. Let's go. Ow! Oh! Nearly had it. Right. What is this? Rocket launcher! Oh my gosh, we go at the same speed as a rocket does. Holy crap, look at that. Oh my gosh, I blew myself up. That was insane though. Wow, the damage. The damage was insane on that. Microwave explosion. Melee damage is obviously heavily emphasized in this game. Holy, there was two of them. I'm on the easiest difficulty. This game is definitely aimed to challenge people, that's for sure. Microwave time. Right, uh, oh yeah, I can set things on fire, can't I? Uh, let's try this. Right, give me that health. Total explosions. Come here, come here, come here. 
Come here. Get back here. Where are you? Where have you gone? Oh, there's one over here. Give me ammo. Thank you. Push him off. Explode him. Where's the rest? Ah, there you are. Shouldn't have tried attacking me. Perfect. Okay, so that's doing something, obviously. How? Okay, so we need to punch this. We need to then run across jump jump oh so close let's try once more right so we're over nice oh And let's get this rune. Okay, so we can either perform glory kills faster, gain a speed boost, uh, survive one death blow, or increase how long enemies remain in a staggered state. Well, I haven't had a problem with that. Temporarily slow down time. I feel like glory kills faster would be a good one. Savagery. Let's go for that. That's not even part of a mission. Where are we supposed to be going then? There is obviously something else around here. It shows that it's this way. Let's try getting back up there. Here we go. That makes more sense now. Right, use that. What on earth is that? Woo! Okay. Um, plasma rifles. There you go. Let's microwave this guy. S 
sliced into a million pieces. Uh, let's go to the runes quickly. Okay, so we have two equipped. We have both the further distance and that one. Door has been unlocked. And let's get our um, thingy. Combat drone thing. Um, so we've got the rocket launcher, which gives us a lock-on burst. Uh, that would be very useful. I feel like lock-on burst is going to be good. Um, yeah, you definitely want at least one mod on every weapon as you're going through. Right, uh, here we go. What is this? Ah, here we go. The beast was dear to me, my brothers and sisters, but he is weak. Your hate must match his will. Only then will you be truly safe. Okay, um, plasma rifle. Let's get that out. Oh my gosh, what is that? Literally, you can't get near the big guys anymore. Okay, so by the looks of it as well, the heavy cannon might be better off if you take the scope now. Because I remember in the last game, you don't want to... The scope really wasn't that useful. But obviously now, it sort of does a huge amount more damage. Holy crap. Eat. Give me that. Right, uh, plasma. Whoo! Tasty. Microwave. Completely dead. Unreal! This, honestly, the amount of fun that I've had in this game so far. Oh my gosh, I'm low, I'm low, I'm low. Oh my days! How? I couldn't... See, the one problem this game has is the fact that there's no sprint in. And it makes it very difficult to shoot people. Right, get the health, get the health. We're on five health then. Right, let's get that health. Quick, 
get these health potion things. I need to find a smaller guy. There we go. Let's go. Stab. Holy shit. Missiles. Missiles. Yeah. Right. Nice. Oh, that's explosives. Right, plasma rifle time. Microwave. Roses are red. My name is Dave. This poem makes no sense. Microwave. Right, uh, where's this guy gone? Come back. No. Don't you dare do that. Oh, I'm back on not enough. Oh yeah, dash. I need to somehow find a smaller opponent. Unless I do that. Literally have no health, no fuel. Give me this armor. How come there's no little ones? Okay, that's enough for plasma. That's a good shout. Okay, nice. I was literally just running around looking for ammo. Perfect. Right, that has opened up a new area off towards this direction. Yes. Holy crap, that was difficult. Ah, Jesus fuck. I heard him. I didn't see him. Gobble, gobble. Eat up. Explosion. Pop. Okay, I want that. Sentinel battery acquired. And then there's this thing to punch. Uh, not quite. There's something hidden up there. Let's see what, whether we can find it or not. It's always worth a shot. Oh no, you only get one extra jump. It's two extra boosts, one extra jump. Ah... Nah, I can't get that yet. So thank you guys so much for watching. If you did enjoy, be sure to leave a like, comment down below and subscribe. If you want to talk more about Doom Eternal and all the stuff going on on the Mechanic CG channel, make sure to join the Discord down in the description below. And if you want to help support the channel, hit that join button. It means the world to me. And I will see you in the next one. Goodbye.